Hello guys, welcome back. Welcome back for our new live. This time I'm being smart and I'm cutting off the little edges so that I don't have to file them. Oh my God, are we doing another hand? Yes, we're doing the same hand, just another set. We finished a little fast, so. And I won't, won't be here tomorrow. So, gotta, gotta pump this content out, huh? I already know that I'm gonna be wishing that these were my nails. Because Emerald be my favorite. Alright, so I have already decided I'm gonna do square again because square is my favorite right now. And I'm just ripping off the little edges so that I don't have to um, file them. Hello, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. I hope you guys went to pee, charge your phone a little bit. Not going to lie, but I did kind of charge my phone at least for the little five minutes that I was gathering my shenanigans. Should I do them long as fuck like this or trim them a little? How long does your shipping take? Um, It normally takes about two to five business days once it's shipped, depending on where you live. Okay, y'all tapping away right now. Yes, I love that energy. Let's see. Let's see if we could get to 200K. Love that my phone has long battery. Woo! Hola Lucy, ¿cómo estás amiga? Aquí vamos a hacer unas uñas de esmeralda. The hand freaked me out. You know what? One of these days, I'm going to do another San Judas set. So I could put a charm on it. Ooh, those are going to be for me, not for you, bitch. So don't try to steal my ideas. No le puedo contar mis diseños a la clienta porque luego, luego me la quieren robar la pendeja. You don't got enough money anyway. Faster than Amazon. We try our best. You know, your voice, your voice girl. I love it. Yeah. We're going to do some Bushona shit on my, on my nails. Not this bitch. Fuck this bitch. Nah, just kidding. She also going to get a good, a good set right now. So today, I mean, for this set, we're going to do bling emerald. Beautiful nail, bling nail for you, honey, because I like you. She don't have enough. Yeah, my client, she only gets four nails. So she's going to get some balm. Ah, oh, fuck, my little napkin always gets stuck. What the fuck, acrylics? Oh, man, I had some wet acrylic that I was watching over here. And it got stuck. I forgot the lid was still wet. Yeah, I'm going to do Esmeralda. I was debating whether to do solid color, but I think I'm going to save the solid ones for my San Judas color. So these were the two other colors that I was looking at, but Esmeralda just wins. We're into glitter right now, so we're into glitteration. Esmeralda crystals. Ooh, which client is this? The same one. We're just doing her other hand now. She said to go big, go home on this hand because the other one was a little too simple. So I was like, okay, girl, okay. So this one, this hand, since we're going to do a little more, we're going to cut less. Oh, fuck. Let me throw these away. All right. I'm going to do just a tad bit. She wants this hand to be a little bit longer because she said she wipes her ass with the other hand. So let's measure you up, sister. Oh, no, no, no. The ring finger is too long. The word of the day. Um, The word of the day. Okay, so before I say the word of the day, here's a really good thing. Thing that I wanted to share with you guys as well. 
So I noticed it right now, but I always, oh shit. Bitch, did I break you? Um, some nail, nail beds from our clients are longer than others. So, um, this one is shorter than this one. I don't know if you guys can tell, but most of our hands have like weird nail beds. So if you guys ever try to do nail forms or stuff like that, the same number won't match. Um, or I've seen people trying to do like those magnet shits for easier sh sizing is not accurate if your fucking client has a nub and a longer nail over here, you know, like it won't be the same because I literally tried to cut the uh, same amount, but check it out. If I go from Kiriko to Kiriko, this one, the ring finger is longer. Um, so I'm just going to trim it a little bit more. So you still have to go and double check. Okay. So that's why too, I don't really care for nail forms because I feel like we try to guide ourselves by numbers. Um, Like, let's just say, oh, my client wants a number two or whatever. I guess now that I really am thinking about it, I probably do the middle finger number three. Or da, 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 da. <sighs> yeah, I measure from cuticle cuticle also. I don't try to do no hack, no none of that shit because I already know my clients and my fucking hands are weird. So, yeah. Just wanted to point that out real quick. I I forgot what somebody asked before I started talking about that. But let me put on my glove again. And my client has requested um a few Frenchies. So maybe I'll do two of them. Two Frenchies. So if you guys are, are new to Frenchies and you like to see the way we do, I'll do right now. Um, I'll do the index finger and the ring finger Frenchies. Yeah. Oh, the word of the day. Um, hmm. Let me think. Let me think. So I'm going to be using the cover pink nude. Word of the day. Um, we're going to go with um, calabaza. That means pumpkin. Oh no, we actually we already had a word of the day earlier. It was um the yams. What the fuck did I call it? How do you say that in Spanish? Camote. Camote. So, Maria here has requested some deep Frenchies. So, I just wanted to show you guys how I do them on a doll versus myself. I like to start off with doing the almond part first. Because back in the day, I used to um, put my bead up here and then try to like drag it down here. And then I would lose control and all that bullshit and... It, I, that's why I think I hated Frenchies because I struggled so much with them. But not no more, honey, not no more. We working there, we working. This one is a number 12. Um, So I try to build my point first. So because I have a really, really long nail and she wants a pretty deep French, we're going to give the illusion that her nail bit is that long. Now, nobody really has that nail bit that long. At least I don't never see nobody. But... Um, it's gonna look nice. Trust, trust me. So that's what I do. And then I work my way to the cuticle and connect the beads as I go. And it's really important for you guys whenever you are working with multiple beads, whether you're building a nail or a nail bed or whatever, you know, like me, nail bed, um, that you thin down the back of the acrylic, like back here, wherever you place the bead, thin it down so that there is no, no line. You'll notice those little lines more with nude colors because it'll start drying. The bead that you previously placed starts to dry. So when you put the next one, because they're nudes and more transparent vibes, you'll be able to see those little lines. So... If you guys ever had those little problems, that's because you didn't thin it down 
and then you went in with another bead when that one was already drying okay so you can see the nail bed right there now I'm just gonna thicken it up a little bit because it's still kind of flat I learned that you have to make the nail bed a little bit thicker so when it's time to file the file can grab onto it really good and you you're able to file the nail bed more perfect if it doesn't come out like perfect perfect because you know it's kind of hard sometimes nail techs I need some advice to keep going and find some time to practice any tips all right guys what tips can you guys give my friend here um I normally find time to practice when oh girl I'm trying to do nails any time of the day she I make time back then though when I used to work go to school and all kinds of shit I would do it on the weekends <sighs> Hola, this cola, honey. Hey. All right, so the tricky part about French is getting them to be kind of even. So this bitch has slim fingers. This bitch has um slim fingers, so her Frenchies can be too wide. I mean, they could if she wanted them to be more round. But if we're going to go deep in there, they have to be a little slim. So every client that you do is going to be different because I have clients who be like, oh, I want this shape, but their fingers are obviously not the same. So it's never going to be the same for everybody or for every finger. One finger will look different than another. I'm not like super picky and shit as far as like they need to match at the same level, the Frenchies, as long as they're like similar that's all that matters to me i'm just gonna eyeball it. it does not have to be like perfection yeah this hand is from red iguana it is pretty real looking she my home girl my home girl maria that's what we named her if you guys would like to shop you guys can find it at rediguana.com you guys can use this con code Zule for 10% off. How much was your uh, practice hand? I believe this one is 75 cookies. I haven't gone back to look, but they gifted me this one for being a loyal customer for a few years. I've been buying their hands for a few years now. I believe I bought like four of them. I was about to say she got pretty perfect hands. Mm-hmm. All right, so I'm going to put my next bead. So I'm doing the nude parts first because, you know, once you pop out that glitter, it's like hell to remove the motherfucker. Zule, can you say the Frenchy part about the lines? I missed it. Um, oh, okay, okay. So I was saying that when you're working with just nude in general, not just French, when you're using nude, like right here, I put my bead and I blended it downwards, but my the end of my bead is thin. So to avoid those little lines, those little dry lines, you want to always thin down your bead. So let's pretend I'm putting the next one right now. I'm putting it right here. Let's pretend that's where it ends. This part up here needs to be thin in order to avoid the those little lines because the reason why the line is noticeable is because you left it too thick and it's already drying so when you put the next one this is too high and it doesn't cover it's kind of like if you're doing an ombre and you don't blend the ombre you know how you see a harsh line that happens but with nude i hope that makes sense so then um, is the most common with nudes because they're more like transparent or not full coverage. 
So if you guys have ever, ever experienced that, that's why. I have, that's happened to me a lot of times. Even now, sometimes I forget, like, oh, fuck, I didn't put enough. And it happened to me. So I just wanted to point it out right now that we're working with a nude and a Frenchie. I love a deep French. Me too, me too. Which acrylic is good to work with and what primer also do you recommend? Maria, girl. Well, I'm sure you're new to my to my TikTok. Um, I do have my own brand, girl. I recommend my brand. It is great and it's affordable. That's a, that's everything that I'm using today. I'm using my acrylic. I'm not using any primer on the hand because it's not real. But if I was doing my own nails, you would see me prepping with my Ultimate Prep Trio. That one is really good. And the girls here can tell you the reviews. If you guys have used any of my products, comment down below. I don't pay nobody to, to say good stuff, okay? Even people be talking shit about my stuff sometimes too. And it's okay. It's not for everybody. But for the most part, we have happy reviews. Why do my brushes flare so bad? I've tried Panna, Kira Sky. What do you mean by flare? Like, like they open up like this? I use your... Your gel and bling cluster gel. Yeah, beautiful. Are you using acetone? No. No acetone. Did you cut the... Yes, I trimmed the nails just a little bit. So right now I'm not using any acetone. It's kind of warm in here. So my acrylic dries fairly fast when it's hot. Well, any acrylic dries faster when it's hot. When the temperatures cool down, then we're going to be struggling, okay? All right, I, I'm going to do... I feel like my first French came out better. Let me just fix this one a little bit. Let me add a little bit more to this side. I'm over here hella confident with my French. But normally one French comes out better than the other. I don't know why it just does like if you make me do 10 it's like three out of 10 are gonna be perfect eh. <laughs> is this set is this the set that gonna have black we changed our mind we're not doing black we're doing emerald I'm not sure if you left but we we made a poll we decided we didn't want black no more we doing a whole different look. No fall. We doing bling. Bling, bling. Okay. The nails are a pointed shape. Do you cut the sides? What? Is that a fake hand? Yes. Okay. So next I will be doing... Um, I'll be doing... Hmm... I think I'm going to do the pinky nail all emerald. Let me get a bigger brush, actually. So I'm going to be using my number 16 Kalinsky brush now. So I could start adding flitter. And this color is called Esmeralda. It's so fucking beautiful. Check it out. Gorgeous, 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 good, gorgeous. We ended up, I don't even know how we ended up with changing color. I think everybody was like, you've done too much black already. You do a different color. And then we wanted to do pink. Oh, shit. We wanted to do pink. And then somebody else suggested emerald. And then we had a pole. And then emerald win. Um, the top coat is 15 cookies. I love this color, the emerald. So gorgeous. I love, 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 love. Right now, you guys are going to see it in the French. It's going to look so sexy. So sexy, honey, for you. 
I don't know if you guys could see the color properly, but my camera does not show me how green it is. What do you think about MMA monomer? Um, I don't know what you expect my answer to be other than it's mm, illegal here, well, at least in California. I do not use MMA monomer. I used it once when I was a beginner because I didn't know any better, but most nail supplies sell MMA guys and they don't tell you that it's MMA. So again, back to our early topic, don't buy things that are too cheap. Even, even if, even if you broke, all right, even if you fucking broke, you do not buy the MMA. It's like. You broke to do drugs and you're going to buy the ones that are going to kill you faster. Like, the fuck? Well, I mean, they don't give a fuck, right? People who do the drugs don't give a fuck. But we do. We ain't trying to die. That shit is bad for you. For your nail. For your... um, For your nose. For your organs. For everything, you know? Because not only do they go on your nails, but the fumes is not good. Even just regular monomer fumes is not good for us, you know, but it doesn't matter how long she take. It take what it take. Let's see. Would you ever what? Do a course? What they saying? That I'm a slow bitch? What the fuck they say? Um, who are you talking to, Pusher? I want to see who it is. Who are you talking to, honey? Oh, man, I missed it. Majority of popular nail brands do not have MMA. MMA, mostly, you will find it in a regular nail supply store, Okay. The chemical in the nail supplies can cause problems with your lady parts. Wear a mask. Mm-hmm. Wear a mask always. And I'm wearing a glove because I don't want to mess up my nails. I just got them done yesterday. And comments getting wild. Man, I want to fucking look at them. I know I'm like, who do I got to fight or slap or whatever? All right, so there is the pinky. Hmm. I'm going to do an ombre on this one. I'm missing out on the fucking... On the she's me. Oh, they're talking about the fucking video still. Oh, my God. Y'all are... Fucking stupid if you believe everything on TikTok. Don't believe everything you see and hear on TikTok, please. That video was a fucking joke. Relax. And even if I did charge 3K for some nails, what's it to you? Some people have no sense of humor. Mm -hmm. I just saw something about 3K. Like, people are fucking dumb. I swear. Oh, it's because I posted a video. Um, I forgot which nails. Oh, my last set. Um, My last set of nails. The fall ones. With an audio that says, oh, I find it disrespectful that, um, how do you call it? I find it disrespectful that people are asking, I don't know what the fuck it said. I charged 3000 for this, but it's like an old, uh, old audio. And I've used it a few times already in the past, but this time it just got like all these crazy people fucking believing that it's true. Like, bitch. Bitch. People always think the audio is real and it's mm-hmm. Yeah. People people funny. People funny. 
But anyway, let's get back to these nails. The red and black nails were to die for with the 3D rose. Yeah. This color is called Esmeralda. Go to the glitter acrylic section and it should be right there. So I have my acrylics um, separated. If you're trying to buy a solid color, you have to go to the acrylic. I'm not sure if it says solid acrylic or just acrylic. Um, and then the glitters are somewhere else. The glitter acrylics are in the glitter acrylic category. How much is this set? It's 3000 <laughs> It's 3000 just like this, plain. One hand, because these little, these little flitters right here are real diamonds. Straight from the earth's core, but crushed. Crushed, so it makes it more expensive. The real emeralds. The real emeralds, guys. Alright, so I'm trying to do an ombre here with the nude and this glitter here getting in my way. Let me refill my Monoma limited edition. What? The acrylic, if it's limited edition? No, it's not limited edition. Wow, you do beautiful. Why are you giving her a discount? It's because I like her. Eh. <sighs> okay. Beautiful. Didn't we have downy? Downy? I don't know. I never bought none. We had the little pebbles. Yeah, but then we had them, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Or did your mom use them up? I have no idea. Why? Because Patrick left us clothes on Sunday and it's Oh, hell no, Patrick. I'm using... um. Oh, he left already. I'm using my number 16 Kalinsky brush. So normally the... The cuticle beads are the most tricky. You have to point down the finger... So I'm just going to bring this down and then I'm going to add acrylic to it right now. I mean, glitter, flitter. I'm going to um add a little bit of flitter right now. What the fuck was I saying? Oh, it's because Patrick forgot to dry his clothes. Fucking Patrick. Fucking Patrick. Fucking Patrick. So I'm going to bring up my flitter just a little bit. Because glitter is life. Um, This hand is real. My Her name is Maria. She, she tends to do modeling. So... That's why she looks a little fake. She's a professional. She's a professional at the modeling, guys. Yeah, she's pretty quiet. She got her Pandora on her Netflix and all of that. Yeah, Maria is super quiet. She likes to just not talk. Because then she starts moving. She's the type of person that like talks and then moves her whole body, you know, and I be fucking her up. So she don't want to get hit today. That's why she quiet. All right. So let me close my jaw real quick. <laughs> let me close my stuff really quick so I could file my Frenchies. And um, I won't contaminate my stuff. Gumby's wife. Hey, Wendy. How are you? Maria better not act up. Mm -mm. Never seen such a high finger look so squishy and bendy. Uh-huh. It's because Maria, she crazy. and She's out of this world. 
break her finger. She keeps talking shit. I'm going to break her fucking nail. I'm going to break her fucking nail if she talks. She's the type of people that talk about like, and she goes like that. I'm good. I'm being very productive today. This is our round two set. Can you guys believe that? Oh my gosh. One nail really does make a difference, huh? In time. Mm-hmm. She don't talk because she mind her own business. Hell yeah. All right. So I'm just going to fight it a little, a little bit. Someone asked, but would you encapsulate the glitter or do you just leave it like that? No, 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 no. You encapsulate the glitter all the time. I'm just not going to encapsulate it yet because I'm going to add more glitter right now to these fingers and then I'm going to encapsulate them all at the same time. Always encapsulate glitter. Always. Because, how do you call it? Um, When you file glitters, most of them will turn silver. They are like coated with cut with a color. Oh, thank you for the roses. Thank you for the roses. It's okay, but they're not perfect. We don't look for perfection here. We just try to make them as good as possible. But Maria don't care if they're perfect or not. All right, so we're going to do the same glitter on these two nails. And the Frenchies, how do you call it? Are, I feel like the index finger came out more perfect than the other one, but whatever. All right, let's do this. So if you guys haven't got Esmeralda in your collection, you missing out, honey. This color is fucking beautiful. It's so fancy. Will you add green gems to this set? Of course, honey. I have some emerald green bling. Actually, that's why I ended up choosing this color um instead of a solid one because i felt like this one just matched the best this color matched the best with the crystals that i'm gonna be using and this color is gorgeous so why not kevin giving zule all the roses oh yes thank you Who's Kevin? Kevin, my new follower? I'm going to keep... What? I'm going to keep him muted for the roses. We love roses here, Kevin. <laughs> Who the hell's Kevin? I wish there was a 25 hours. Oh, okay. I see you, Kevin. Thank you. But how about you get me something more expensive than a rose? If you like this color, Kevin. Thank you, Kevin. We love flowers. Ooh, he my top viewer. Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. I'm going to give him a shout out. <laughs> yeah. I'll be getting more roses here than in real life. Okay, okay. Try it. <laughs> Kevin trying to get to heaven. How about you buy me a limited edition... Um, I don't know what the fuck sticker, whatever the hell it's called. Um, Kevin, she loves dogs and happy meals. I do the corgi or what was it? I like the happy meal. Happy meal. What was he saying? Why is he muted? Why'd you guys mute him? Okay, Kevin, we see you. He didn't do nothing. Then who muted him? Now give us a happy meal. Hmm. He loved nail. He loved a nail. We should make a nail with Kevin with a K for you. 
That's funny. Paige, did you mute him? This color is gibbon. I think I'll have to do nails in this color so Kevin could give us a, a happy meal. Was it hard when you first started doing nails? Um, I want to say it was. Ooh, I got a happy meal, but it's not from Kevin. Ya se fue el güey, ya le gastamos el dinero. Oh, those little, are those Happy Meals new? Thank you, la nice daddy, or, wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, no, that's Julia. Thank you, Julia. Um, Let's see what Kevin commented. Okay, where where he go? Kevin, where are you? I'm I'm at 420. You getting high or something? Love the nails. Okay, thank you, Kevin. Is this your new favorite color? I want some nuggets and fries. Mm-hmm. Me too. I love chicken nuggets. For some reason, when I hear that name, Kevin, it reminds me of the minions. Kevin! 350 is five cookies. Oh, okay. You know when that minion gets lost? I'm like, come in. Okay. Papoy. <laughs> papoy, papoy. Yeah. Or I'm going to bring this a little higher. Is there any Minions stickers? That would be cute as fuck right now. Show off your set, please. Maybe he likes roses. Paint a rose design, but with a green stem in the rose thorns. Put K for Kevin. Oh, mira, está bien. Bien cursi, la amiga. All right, we gave Kevin a shout out now. I don't know. Oh, hold on, hold on. Mira, Kevin, aquí andas todavía? I'm the tropical bird from up. Okay, look, Kevin, this one's for, this is for you, look it. Ooh, a rose for a rose. I should probably just leave my nails out. I made minion nails back in 2015. Maybe I get more roses now. Or or a, a fucking happy meal. I'm low-key going to have to go to McDonald's to get me a happy meal. Did you go to school or are you self-taught? I am a licensed manicurist. I have been licensed for going on nine years. So definitely I am I went to school but I have also learned on my own a lot of things from going well not on my own but I've taken courses. So it's really important for you guys to take classes to continue learning because you don't know what you can learn from other people, you know? Like we can learn a lot on YouTube and shit on lives and all of that, but there's other people who have way more knowledge that you would ever think of, you know, like you feel you can never stop learning. You feel like, you know, everything. But once you take a class, it's like, boom, boom, honey, you learn something new. Um, This color is called Esmeralda. It is available on my website. I got Lori and Janie mixed up. How? You are the person who charges three. Yeah, that's me. That's me. You want to book an appointment? 
What brush are you using? I am using a size 16 Kalinsky brush. Zule sing for us. I don't know how to sing. What do I sing? She blocked cuz bye. <laughs> do you have that color without the glitter as well? Um, I want to say the color closest to this one without glitter is going to be the forest or maybe number. Hold on, I'll show you. Um, hold on, let me finish this little bead. Hello. How much is that brush? I don't remember the prices from the top of my head. I'm sorry. You had to check on the website. The link's on the bio. I don't remember all the prices for everything, guys, because I have a lot of items. So if you guys would like to check out prices for anything, it would be um, on the website. So I have these other two colors. Look, they're nice and dark, these two. Um, I want to say the lighter one is number 115. And then the darker one is 134. But I also have one that's lighter, is more green, which is called Forest. <sighs> oh, shit. I'm not done yet. Is it hard to do your other hand? It's hard, but not impossible. Um, do I have pink sugar? Yes, I do. It should be under the sweet sugar glitters. Go to the to the um loose glitter category and it should be there. You laugh like minions. So cute. Me? Okay, thanks. you welcome. You're welcome. And somebody asked me that where do I get my big crystals? These are Swarovski crystals on my hands. Um, I bought them a while ago, like a, literally a year. Oh my gosh, honey. Um, Stephanie, if you want to place an order, we can definitely meet up somewhere, girl. Your friend just text me. Um, can I see the nails on your hand? Hold on. Let me just finish this right here. Because my client wants a deep, deep French. A deep, deep, deep. All right. So this is one hand. Swarovski won't sell the individual crystals no more. Nope. I still have some on my website. So if you guys want to check out, they are under the highest quality crystals. Those are the Swarovski ones. I don't have like the biggest variety no more, but we still have a good amount. I should probably put her a ring. Come on, bitch, get in there. All right, so that's Esmeralda for you. Let me take a picture of it. It's so fucking gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Wow. Ooh, la la, so pretty. Is like, honey, if you don't got this color, then where you been at? Damn, my eyes are hurting already. Okay, now let's encapsulate this. Um, The ring is from Yia Accessories. She's here on TikTok. Yia, Y-A, Y-I-A Accessories. She has beautiful, um, beautiful, oh shit, this is nude. 
she has beautiful um jewelry hmm where did my clear go who stole my clear who stole my clear thank you thank you um what's the name of that color zule it is called esmeralda thank you Paige. Uh, yeah if you guys want to buy uh this fake hand or a finger or whatever i do have a code with red iguana if you guys want to save some coin you can use my name zule and save 10 percent off And I, I don't have a discount code with Yia. Her prices are very, very reasonable. And the quality is amazing. I actually just bought myself an ojito ring. Because I want to do myself a set with the little eyes again. The um, evil eye or whatever the fuck it's called. And I'm like, let me get my jewelry ready, honey. So I went ahead and bought me two more rings so that I can matchy matchy. Matchy matchy matchy. Is that a human hand or a mannequin? It is whatever you want it to be. It's a mannequin. Is Rediguana on TikTok? Yes, she's on TikTok and on Instagram. I love when you say honey. You love it, you love it, honey. Honey, 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 honey. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm starting to get high. Because I got high. What is the what? The name of the jewelry? Hold on. Let me go get a little thing so I can show you guys right now. Um I don't wanna be here at work. I'd rather be home redoing my nails like the red ones. Yes, Martha girlfriend. Go do your nails. Fuck work. Eh, just kidding. No, 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 no. You need to work, Martha, so you could get some more cookies. So you can come to the pop-up and or join the next school party. I don't know when it is, but I hope soon. Yeah, accessories is hold on. I'll, I'm gonna show you guys a business card right now. Okay, so I'm just trying to make this nail thick enough. I want to say she has a bunch of A's on her name. But I'll show you guys right now. I want a piña colada. All right, hold on. Let me go get her business card and a ring so I can show you guys real quick. Look, guys, this is her website. Oh, yeah, she has multiple A's. Yeah, accessories. She's here on TikTok. So let me show you guys the ring that I got. And I bought this with my own money. I promote her because her shit is bomb. When I love something, I always promote without expecting anything in advance because we gotta support each other and then i always got i also got this one it's so cute i'm gonna put them on her fuck it fuck it thug life meanwhile i start fighting when i start fighting i'll take them off
All right. Ooh, and then I got this one too. This one is pretty. It looks like one that I already have, but with bling, with little bling. All right. So that is her website, Yia Accessories. She's here on TikTok. So I'm gonna leave that on my little um I'm gonna leave them on my hand meanwhile and then um I'll take them off when I file. The eye one is cute, huh? I was like, I need that in my life. I wish she had more. I mean she has a wide variety. Um, but I was like, let me pick the ones that will fit best because I have chubby fingers, you know? Let me just encapsulate this real good. And then I'm on time for cheese mess. Gotta get into this because I need to go to sleep early today. Damn, I made it kind of fat. That has to be hard to do everyday tasks with what? With my nails? You better not be talking about my nails. She, because if you're talking about my nails, bad bitch lifestyle ain't for everybody, boo boo. It ain't. Oh shit, it's right on me. Bitch, this, these nails is popping. These nails are like part of a fucking of of my hand. It's like if I don't have nails on, it's like I'm missing the arm and shit. Let me encapsulate this one. I, I don't know why, but this ombre is one of my favorite nails. Should have fucking done the pinky ombre too. That would have been cute. That would have been cute. I want to say something fucking dumb, but I don't want to get blocked. So, mejor no. Keep that to yourself, honey. <laughs> yeah, it is an extension, man. How much for this set? I'm not sure if it's a joke, but if it is, we're going to say five five k. Missing an arm. Mm hmm. I feel like I'm missing an arm. Literally. Literally. What? What? <laughs> yeah. What? Five K pesos. Let's see, Alexa, how much is five thousand pesos in American dollars? Five thousand Mexican pesos is about two hundred forty-eight U.S. dollars and ninety-eight cents. Okay, so I'm gonna start saying this: five thousand pesos. <laughs> We is five thousand pesos. Five million pesos. Okay. Alexa, how much is five million pesos in American dollars? Five million Mexican pesos is two hundred forty eight thousand nine hundred seventy. We could be rich, rich. I'm be like, bitch, I'm Mexican. That 3K meant pesos. <laughs> Why y'all acting dumb? Don't you see my nopalón? Que no me ven el nopalón en la frente? That's worth 100 to 150, not 200. Well, excuse me. This user don't like you. 
you can't tell me what my work is worth, okay? Because it's like your your employer telling you you're not worth whatever you're asking for. So you can never tell somebody their work is not worth what they're asking for. So if you get paid 10 cookies in your job, how would you feel if your employer be like, you're not worth those 10 cookies? You're worth two. Two cookies. You're going to be like, the fuck? Fuck you. Exactly what my answer is. All right? I charge you whatever the fuck I think my worth is. And if you don't like it, then shut the fuck up. You ain't fucking paying, so shut the fuck up. Ain't nobody need that kind of negativity up in here. All right? Nobody fucking cares about your opinion if it's negative. If you ain't paying for my bills, shut the fuck up. You got no right to come and fucking tell me I'm not worth what I'm asking for. She's watching from the window now with the other hater. Yeah, so it fucking annoys me when people try to tell me I'm not worth what I'm asking for. Like, who are you to fucking tell me that? But if we flip the roles, we flip the script, and I tell you you're not worth what you asking your employer for, then you're going to get mad? People who... Who be doing that probably don't even fucking do their own job at work. So shut up. Say you're broke without saying you're broke. <laughs> For real. Like go back to your fucking job and actually do your job please. Thanks. Bye. Like. The fuck. The fuck. Hoodie. Yep, on the way for the bling. Mm-hmm. Almost there. You can do evil eye set. Uh-huh, I am. That one's going to be 6,000 cookies. Next time. Maybe next week. Mm, yeah. I said what I said. I had to be said already. I'm going to make that an audio. <laughs> That's going to be my next audio on my nails. Like, bitch. Bitch, don't tell me how much I'm fucking worth, motherfucker. Zule and Porsche worth 100k a piece for one nail. Mm, we because a motherfucker. Oh, when you did, you did red. Said I miss. Oh, don't worry. I'll be posting it on YouTube soon. It looks real. I will definitely use that audio for real, man. Like, the book. The book. Six thousand and one cookies. I don't know who needs to hear this. Eh, Wendy, to see some to see some the rings, I got them from here. Yeah, accessories. And don't come at my, at my girl and tell her to lower her prices either, okay? You pay what you pay, all right? Now, her prices are very reasonable. Do you have a salon? Um, I do not own a salon. I do work in one, but I don't own one. And I do not want to own one either. How much was it? Um, the ring? I do not remember. Um, I don't remember. I ordered them like a week ago. And I ordered a few. So they range. I want to say they're between um, 10 to 15 cookies. Um, the company for the rings. It's Here, let me show you again. This is it. Take a screenshot real quickly. Take a little screenshot. This is where I got the rings. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram yet, make sure to follow me on Instagram. I always tag them on my post when I use the rings. So you guys can find them there too. It 
exactly what kind of cookies. The green ones, the Benjis. The Benjis and the Washingtons. If you if you catch my drift. Now me thinking that was a real hand, huh? It looks like a real honey. Thank you, Portia. I'm gonna have to um tag her. Chocolate chip. Don't trip potato. No, wait, come on. Don't trip potato chip. Dude, me too. I thought it was real. Mm -hmm. These are the new. These are the new um red iguana hands. The 3.0. 3.0. I'm finding my dip nails are a bitch to remove. Oh, yeah, that does take a while to soak off, huh? I need that green, green, green. Go get it, girl. Go get it before it's gone. It's called Esmeralda. Esmeralda. It's giving a rubber hand. <laughs> a rubber hand job. Is what is giving she Oh shit, I was about to whistle right now. No Zule, no whistling ma'am. Thanks to Zule. I have one. Oh Esmeralda. Ooh yeah. I was like, yeah, Persia girl, you need it in your life. It's so pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Can you use dip powder as acrylic? Yes. Dip powder is acrylic. It's just very, very, very fine. That's why it will dry so much slower. Because the little molecules or whatever the fuck are extra tiny. So, fuck, man. There's a fucking orange glitter right there. I guess I'm going to put a flower there or something. Do you still do nails on clients or are you focused on your product? I still do clients. I work part-time doing nails, but I do focus on my um on my online store and my products, you know. Doing these lives is like my job. We can't see. TikTok didn't notify me. What is the best acrylic or gel? Um, well, I'm only going to recommend you my own product because I don't really use other gel. Um, but other good brands for acrylic is um, Young Nails, Valentino's, Valentino Nudes are good, Vanessa Nails, Nail Prof. Those are the ones I use at the salon. But gels, I've never tried. I well, I have tried a long time ago, but I haven't tried any recent ones. Yeah, this is the Red Iguana 3.0 in shade Nicole. Oh, Gel X. I thought you meant gel. Her and Portia work for me, providing me videos. Uh-huh. Pageation. You better be likey Asian. Likey, likey. Comment, comment. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and take off the rings because the other day I scratched one by accident. So we'll be seeing you soon. Um, I'm from California. Pages are pimp. <laughs> All right, it's so not time to file. We're in Cali where the money is. 
the money and the expensive everything is Kelly. Here in Kelly, we're forced to make more money because the cost of living is expensive as shit. I've never gone to another state, so I wouldn't know what it's like somewhere else. But one day I shall move out of Cali. Shit, right here, everything is expensive as shit. That's why we gotta work hard. Work, 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 work. I don't know how anyone can afford a house in California. That's why we have to work our asses, man. Sometimes I wish I lived in another state because it's so hard to compete with other people. Because the cost of living here is so fucking ridiculous. Like, what the hell? What the hell? That's why Zule is always working. Not even Cali, just LA. Well, some parts of California are cheaper, but they're still expensive compared to other places. How much is gas there? Um, The other day, it was seven cookies and like 20 cents or something like that. Diesel fuel, I have no idea. Don't compete. You'll only go in debt. Compete with who? I ain't competing with nobody. I have a friend who used to live in Kelly and she said no one actually owns their homes on this rich. That's true because technically, technically you're still paying it off to the bank. Our guess is three. What? Three cookies? Don't come to Koreatown, LA. We expensive. Yeah, that's why every time somebody asks me for a discount, it's like, sorry, boo-boo, no can do. Gotta pay rent this month. <laughs> I cannot do. And then our our taxes are really high, too. It's crazy. I heard that California has the highest, um, one of the highest fucking income tax. So some some states, some states don't pay income tax, but here in California, we do. We do. So all our money we make in a year, if it's income tax, we get taxed on that shit too. So we pay taxes on the products we buy. We get taxed for fucking our income. We get taxed for this, tax for that, for farting. Nah, just kidding. Good night, Jimena. We get taxed for everything. I pay nine seventy five for three bedrooms, girl. Out here for three bedrooms, minimum rent is like two grand. Mm hmm. I live in the Bay Area, so yeah, shit is expensive. Like the fact that I gotta pay to cross the damn bridge, for real, man. That's cray cray. Yeah, right here in, in where I live when I go to work. I live in Glendale, two bedroom apartment, 2200. Expensive. I thought you said 3000 for a nail. I did, and shit. I'm telling you, this rent is crazy, so I'm gonna make up. <laughs> Three bedrooms, 1800 in Kissimmee, Florida. Oh, not bad, not bad. East LA, three bedroom, 1800. It's too much, specifically for a single mom. Mm hmm. It's fucking expensive. 
my parents just bought a house 3k mortgage payment where where'd they buy it at what state is that 1000 for three three bedroom what here in la county oh i believe that i paid 900 for mortgage damn honey if my mortgage was 1k i would stop working like y'all would not see me here live i'll be like deuces guy I, i'm gonna go vacation I'm on vacation. I ain't gonna work a shit. I just kidding. I still be fucking working. I'm a workaholic, bitch. I just will not go do nails no more for work. I'll be like, I'm just gonna collect roses on TikTok to pay my mortgage. Fuck that. <laughs> do you regret moving to Kelly? Well, Kelly's all my life. This is where I was born. I don't know any different. I don't know anything different. That's why to me it's kind of normal, you know? The struggle, the grind is a part of life. Because that's all I know. Until not too long ago when I started to talk to my um, to my followers and things like that. Having conversations about like payment, mortgage payments, rent payments on other places. Is when I realized like, damn... It is expensive over here. But definitely where I moved, it's cheaper than L.A. I used to live in L.A. and it was ridiculously expensive. So I moved somewhere cheaper. L.A. so fun though. The way I grew up, I, would change, I wouldn't change it for anything. Yeah, it was fun. And dangerous at the same time. She, how many times could we not die? Mm -hmm. My son is in Oklahoma and you get a nice house for 1K. Yeah, where do you live now? I live in the fucking desert, honey. Ooh, thank you for the roses, Susie. Now for real, I'm from Inglewood. Mm -hmm. It's like cray cray. Like, dude, I could have died when I was younger. What the fuck? In Toronto, 2900 for three bedroom. Yeah, see, it's expensive to live, man. Yeah, it just makes you appreciate what you have. Definitely, definitely. Definitely. Hold on, let me take this off too. No, I do not live in the high desert. I live over here by the Morongo Casino. It's still considered um oh um it's Riverside County. How much is this set? Um, a million cookies. And don't you live in Bomanzule? I sure do. I sure do, honey. I live in Beaumont, California. It's by the Morongo. But some people don't know where Beaumont is at. So I just say the Morongo. Because people know where the Morongo is at. They do know that. Alrighty, these nails are coming out perfect, perfect. I like it over there. It's nice and relaxing, no noise. Zule wasn't trying to say her city and y'all exposing her. She's trying to be low-key. <laughs> well, no, not necessarily. Well, for the strangers that are just walking past, they don't need to know, but... Y'all can see, when you guys place an order, you guys can see what city it's shipping out from. Do you have to drive far for groceries? Nope, not at all. It's real close. 
Well, I consider everything close by now because I work far as shit. Like, my nearest Costco is like 30 miles away. But because I go to work 80 miles away, that shit ain't nothing. People are weird. You gotta be careful who you tell where you live for real. Because you already know we got people trying to steal my stuff. Do you like the practice hand more than the plastic ones from Amazon? Yes, girl. Do not invest in plastic Amazon or any plastic hands. Those suck ass. Those suck ass. They do not bend. You cannot recycle the fucking nails. You have to fucking clip those motherfuckers off. Mm-hmm. People weird. All right. Um, how do I remove the lines? Right now, I'm just filing and then i'm gonna go in with my electric file which is an extra fine bit which removes the fine the lines the deep ones do you have recommendations for gel polish on acrylic not peeling um one thing that i've learned is to not leave the nails too smooth the gel needs something kind of um rough to adhere to so remove majority of the scratches but not all of them where can i buy one of those hands it's from rediguana.com like it's a little investment the hand but it's definitely worth it i do recommend it so, how to call it? Um, you guys can ask Sancho Close for it or something. What bit is that? It is the extra fine bit. This is my B F F F F. It's my favorite bit. You can find it on my website as well. Why do you recommend a fake hand? Because um i personally can't do my nails every fucking day i wish i could my nail beds will be crying um but the fake hand you can work on every day if you don't have clients even if you do have clients sometimes you want to do something last minute or maybe you don't want to do clients you just want to express yourself your creativity on a fake hand You know, and then um, the good thing about the fake hands is that you can come and go as you please. Like you're like, oh, I need to go to the restroom. I need to go grocery shopping or whatever. You can always come back to the fake hand and finish the nails later versus a real person. Like, yeah, you can go to the restroom, but you can't tell your client, like, you know what? I'm going to go to the store. I'm going to go to the store. I'll be back in like an hour. Your client's going to be like, the fuck, bitch, finish my fucking nails. You know? How much they go for? Um, They vary. So you'd have to check out the website. But I think the hands start at like 75 cookies. Around there. Um, They did give me a discount code too for 10% off. You just type in my name, which is Zule. And it should save you some coin. And for those of you guys who are not very good at math, it's 10 cookies off 100 cookies. Right? That's the math. I'm over here like, wait, did I say you correctly? <laughs> uh huh. So it's, it's definitely worth it. And if you are planning to get this hand, get the one with the, with the magnet, the little magnets, the new ones. Um, and then get yourself the little clamp because, because how to call it, it works really good. All right, let me plug in my fucking phone. It's dying. Yeah, if you guys can't afford a hand, you can buy a finger. It is cheaper. Oh shit, no thumb. Yeah, it doesn't have a thumb though, but mm, the fucking thumbs never show anyway, so... 
what is the site for the hens? It is called RedIguana.com. RedIguana.com. If the hands 75 cookie with a discount, it'll be six. Oh, you're on the website right now? Okay, thank you. I bought the hand, but it doesn't stick to that. Um, maybe you, well, I don't know which one you're, you're using, but I don't have a problem with the stand at all. Like it has not fell off, not once since I started using it. Maybe you have to find the little magnets correctly. Zule, do you ever feel like you sound like a broken record? Yes, I do. Actually, I think I'm just used to it already, though. I repeat and repeat. Someone teach me how to mute block comments. So I want to try my mod powers. <laughs> All right, guys. Teach Stephanie the, the ropes. How do you block a bitch? How do you mute them? I don't know how to do it, so. Now we're going to have more, more muting. The hand doesn't fall off the stand. Nope. You have to make sure that you um, put it in the middle of the magnets. So... The stand, I want to say, has six magnets on it. Oh, wait, you can't see it. Fuck. It has six magnets, and there's two on the hand. So you just put it in the middle, in the center. I haven't had an issue with it falling off, and I've been using it for a while now. Even, okay, let me show you the stand. Even um, when I file. So it does have a little suction thing that gets suctioned to a glass desk the best. So check it out. This is the hand. And there is, I can't tell if there's four or six little magnets in there. But see? It's stuck. If you put it like down here, yeah, it's going to fall because the magnets are weak. But as long as it's in the, in the middle, it's... It's strong. It's a strong hold. Even the magnets almost want to come out the hand. That's how strong it is. The hand is from Red Iguana, Amiga Feather. Discount code Zule. Hi Zule. Hey. I'm so excited. I'm gonna get to the bling already. Yes, honey. Yes. Ah oh, shit. I might think I didn't clamp it correctly. We need to pin red iguana for real. I don't know how to pin. If not, I would have done that a long time ago. What desk do I use? Um, I had a custom desk done, but I feel like I'm too small for it. I mean, I'm too big. I got this desk done, but I do not recommend it. That's why I never show it because it's cute and everything, but it's not, doesn't do the job. Like, I supposedly ordered it with a vent, like a little dust collector, and it does not work at all. It does not work. That's why I never really answer that. Because I don't want you guys to buy it because it fucking sucks. But I don't get rid of it because it cost me a pretty penny. Alright, so let me just dust this bitch. And let me just file the tips now. So look at them. They looking fucking bomb. Bomb, bomb. All right, let me put my hand on my... I wish the little clamp moved. Oh, this color reminds you of a Christmas tree?
Stay, you hen. Yes, a glittering Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Mm -hmm. You guys going to make me start singing here. So I'm going to have to tapar las orejas. Fuck, man. Why am I filing crooked? Zule. How often should I be getting a fill? I feel like two weeks. They look horrible. What? They should not be looking horrible at two weeks, girl. But they do recommend two to two to three weeks for a fill. And then, well, it depends on how fast your nails grow. The fuck? Am I tripping? I just saw it look crooked right now, but then I filed it to fix it. Now it looks crooked. All right. Hold on. My eyes are playing games with me. Nails grow so quickly. Yeah, for me, my nails do not grow fast. So, my nails at four weeks look like somebody's at two. I used to go eight, six to eight weeks with the same fucking nails. Can you guys believe that? Before, I can't. Oh, shit. Question, when I get my nails done lately, they burn. Would you happen to know why? It's because um, right now the weather is hot. So when our acrylics start to dry, when they're pro the proper term is polymerizing, or something like that, polymerizing, that means the acrylic is setting. Acrylic will heat up, which is natural. But... You feel it most, you feel that more when the weather is hot because it's the, you know, the air, the temperature is already hot. So hot on hot feels, you could feel it even more. Another reason why it could be hot is because you have um, damaged nails or MMA. But if it's the summer, most likely it's because it's hot. So that's why in the cold, you won't feel it as much, but everything feels hotter when it's, when the temperature is hot. It's kind of like if you're eating a soup, you feel like it's, the soup is hotter on a hot day, you know, it's like, oh my God, I'm fucking sweating, I'm melting. But when you eat it on a cold day, it's like perfect, you know? So just in case you guys never knew that the acrylic gets hot. The acrylic gets hot um, when it's hardening. You should touch the nail ne n n next time. It does. It do. It do. To think it's more damaged than anything, that is why I give my nails a break. Hmm? If you're going to a professional nail tech, you do not need a break. Many things, but most common is no proper prep. I know they are, but I'm buying plenty of stuff. Just thought I would ask. Hmm? What, 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 what? Your nails stay so pretty and don't get scratches. Girl, it's because I took off my glove. I just did them yesterday, too. Okay, let me fix this nail. That's why I wear gloves for the most part, but my hands are starting to get sweaty. So, And then my, my glove ripped. That's why I took it off. But majority of the times... I wear my gloves so that I do not fuck up my nail. So this is what the nails are looking like. Gorgeous. All right. Let me just buff them a little bit. And we're almost done. 
you're going from fall nails to christmas music it's whoever said it looked like a christmas tree um did that to me all right we've been here for an hour and 30 minutes guys oh shit I don't know why, but lately, whenever I think of something, like, like let's just say I say piña colada, I start thinking of the song, I wanna piña colada, or da -da 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 -da, whatever, right? Anything that comes to my brain, I start kind of singing. It's like, what the fuck is wrong with me, yo? And I don't even sing nice, which is the sad part. It's like, I'm hurting the eardrums over here. So somebody said something about a Christmas tree. So then I started to sing the Christmas tree. Yeah, I don't know the lyrics properly. So don't make fun of me. Let me turn on the fucking AC. I'm melting. And then I need to switch on my phone because that one is dying. Oh, all right, let me turn this one off and switch, switch phones. All right, so it's gonna show me the new chat. Oh shit! Shut up, Zule. Shut up. Oh damn, the nail came out. Do you have any kids? I sure do. I have a 14-year-old and a doggy. Someone said to sing and now look at you singing. <laughs> I cannot sing. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb. And We live in the RV, though. You want to see my hands? Eh, just kidding. I know you mean nails. Okay. Let me dust this bitch. Let's see. What, what? What? Did you do nails when your son was younger? How do you do it, girl? My daughter, my daughter, be all about my clients. Girl, yes. Patrick used to be all about my clients too, showing them his dinosaurs and shit. So, is inevitable? 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 I can't fucking talk no more, guys. All right, let me close this up. They just gonna entertain your clients for you. All right, she's not going to get her hands washed right now. I do not want to wash my hands. I mean, I don't want to wash her hands. I don't want to get up. So I'm just going to put her rings right now. So I could bedazzle her because she's about to be the baddest bitch in the room. We need to make her as a Bushona because she about to be a baddie. Wait, that one's too big. I don't have a lot of little rings. That's the sad part. Mm -hmm. Free entertainment while getting your nails done. All right, that's what she gets. The rest are too big for her. All right, let's let's get to this bling action. Let me pop on my bling. I'm not even gonna clean them because they already look clean. We're getting lazier and lazier by the minute. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna take on my good good. And my Zule bling adhesive. Where the fuck are you, you motherfucker? We were just using you. Hmm. Where to go? Oh, there it is. 
All right, so here it is, my bling adhesive. Maybe I should clean the nail so you guys can see the color. Oh my God, Maria does not deserve the good good. She already paid me up front. So I'm going to give her whatever she asked for. Fuck it. I even got tipped in food stamps today. Woo! Woo! And, and she brought me, she brought me a coffee. So she gonna get the good wood. She thinks she balling. Yeah, she paid me cash. She tipped me. Mm -hmm, Cause I told her that I need to go to a grocery. So she hooking me up. She giving me, she giving me um 50 cookies extra. All right, I'm gonna start with the middle one. Hell yeah, that's a tip, honey. That's a tip. All right, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna do the biggest one on the block for Maria because we like her now. Um, This color is called Esmeralda. I'll show you right now. I'm gonna put this one in the middle. We're gonna ice her out with the rocks from the, from the Earth's core. So just in case anybody gonna ask how much these are, they're too expensive. Too expensive. Only those. So this is a color. That's illegal is what it is. Oh my God, my heart hurts. <laughs> why, honey, why? Why, 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 why? Pero bye, bye. I should probably even put her a little charm, huh? Nah, 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 no charm. No charm, she just wants bling. She says she paying the good amount. She's buying, she's paying the good, good for the good, good. I'm like, all right. Yes, these are real crystals from the earth, okay? We stand used to film Zule. Oh, what stand? I use um the Archon Mount stand. I'm going to use a little pear. I use their Archon mount stand. Is it on Amazon? I don't know, but if you want to buy something that's on Amazon, get the gooseneck one. Fuck, I think I put that one crooked. When a fake hand has a better set than me. <laughs> All right, hold on. What's up with me putting fucking bling all sideways? You want me to do gold caviar? Um, I'll do the... I'll do the flat ones only because I have them here, but I don't have gold. I have rose gold, this one. Um, I'm using Zule Bling Adhesive. This is the best glue in the world. Go get it. Only 10 cookies. You can find them. Find it. The link's on my bio. These, these crystals are the good, good. The Swarovski. How do you eat a brownie then? With my fucking mouth? What do you mean? How do you fucking eat a brownie? How do you eat a brownie? I mean, when you're paying 3K for these gems, you need good glue. Hell yeah, shit. You, you ain't trying to lose none, the fuck? And you're going to use this glue. And as a matter of fact, this glue costs more because... 
you can glue your wife with it. So you won't lose her. So if she cheating or something, you won't. She won't be cheating no more. Oh, your hubby. You're going to have him stuck. Stuck for life. All right? Okay, honey. Not even water will fucking split you. Oh, imagine she is labeling adhesive. I'm going to glue my man's credit card on me for real. Glue that shit. Just take a picture of it, girlfriend. You don't need to take a picture. Dios mío, hermosas. Gracias, amiga. Ay, como quisiera que estas uñas serían mías, pero luego no pienso, no pienso. Pinche mona maldita, ¿verdad? Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Mira, wow, wow. This middle finger is um is for those of you haters that don't think these nails are worth 3K, okay? So let me just secure this giant gem from the Earth's crust <laughs> so it does not fall off. She gonna be flipping off bitches like she waving at them. All right. Where can I find the good stones? Um, you can find them on my website under highest quality crystals. They're under the highest quality crystals. That's where they at. Save it. Apple Pay. Mm hmm Do you put them on after? No. I wish, but no. I do not. I should, huh? No más pégate la azulé, ¿verdad? Me las voy a hacer pinche keychain mejor. All right, hold on. I miss. I messed up. I was supposed to leave enough space for a little ball here. But I didn't, so let me pull the little skin down. You know, like, like how you pull your men's. And then push it back. Like nothing ever happened. Just don't push it too far because it's the wet. It's the wet, wet, wet. When he's uncircumcised. For real. If he if he circumcised then you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. You're like what? Like what you saying, Zune? You weirdo. I'm talking about nails here. And these little gold balls definitely be making a big difference, man. When do you use the cluster gel versus regular adhesive? So that is more of a preference. I have customers who just use cluster gel instead of the bling adhesive because it gives you more time to um, work with your, with your stone placement and things like that. So if you need more time because the glue does dry a little fast for some people, um then I would recommend the cluster gel at all times. But I like to use it for clusters, which are the the um, big tumors that I be putting on my nails. Those are... Wait, wait, wait. What the fuck was I saying? Then I use it for that and also for, for pixies. Oh shit, se me secó la verga. Se me secó la verga el pendejo. Damn it. Fucking put it crooked, yo. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. 
did that box sell out i don't see it anymore which box the chaton one what are you guys talking about all right hold on Oh, the emerald one I have? I don't sell this one. This one is my stash, my collection. I do sell a emerald one, but it's not the good good. Alright, let's see. Let me... Let me put some some balls up in here. I just sent 700 likes. Thank you, my friend. We appreciate them. How many likes do we have going on? Oh, no. We're a little slow today, guys. What happened to our, our goal to 200K? It's the Ugg Ugg. Hmm? The who, what, when, where, why? We look at this one. Zam, honey. This one's pointed though. I can't use that one. But I could use this one. Zam, Daniel. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Relax, Daniel. Stay stay right there, motherfucker. Fucking bitch. Stop moving. When I tell you this glue has a mind of its own, I'm not kidding. Let me shove it in. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> the struggle is real. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put one more ball down there. right there i'm hella focused here why are you wasting the good good um because i don't want to know where else to put them i'm gonna put them on my nails too it's because i don't have any other colors this big i mean i don't have crystals that are like the this color is what i meant I need a really little one right here. A little one. Actually, I think I do have a small one. Let me look. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Maybe it's this one. Yeah. Yeah, that one fits. Nah, you know what? I ain't going to leave it there. I'm trying to see your red ones you have on. Sorry. Girl, you don't get bling no more because it pulls your hair? I don't care if it pulls my hair shit. I'm still going to put bling. Bling is life. Your man don't pull your hair? But when your man pulls your hair, it's okay. But I'll bling now. Oh, shit. Fuck, <gasps> oh, my glue fell on the floor. Why do I keep doing that? Why? Show you got the rojo. Mm-hmm. 
All right, we're almost done, guys. We're almost done. Damn, now I want a fucking um, emerald set. I think I'm going to put a little emerald bling right there. Ooh, la la. Alrighty, Zam. Zam. Go off, sis. Have insurance for me. I'm crying. What happened? I want to laugh. Okay, one malt nail. Yes, they are real hands. See, sí, amiga, esto es Swarovski. Should I do an, a flower? Pone chatones. No, no le voy a poner chatones. A flower, huh? I feel like this one should have like a little flower because my French didn't come out that great. Okay, I'm going to put a little flower on this one. Um, How do I get my gems to stay? I use... Zule bling adhesive, my friends. All right, I'm gonna use since this nail's pretty big, I'm gonna use a big bling. Ooh, that looks big, 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 big. Why are her fingers like that? Because she's a very good model. So when I tell her to do the twist, she do the twist. That's why. Don't you guys feel like we like in a in a group chat, like a I mean a chat room back in the day when people used to fight for no reason, fighting each other and shit. Mm-hmm. It's like spread them, bitch. And she spreads the fingers. She spreads the fingers. Twist them, bitch. Okay, anything for my nail. Okay, 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 okay. Spray them, motherfucker. Be like, what do I spread? Like your nails, dumbass? Nah, it's good. <laughs> like spreading the legs and shit. Like, no girl, not that. Alright, well, since I'm already spraying activator, might as well spray them on this one. So I could do a little flower. I'm just going to add a little bit of bling to this one too. Might as well before I do the flower. Yahoo chat room. Mm -hmm. El Yahoo or El AIM or whatever the hell. Like what's your YSL? I don't know. Not a YSL. What was it? The fucking. Um, your ASL. You can't even see the fucking bling here, but fuck it. Just a little diamond. My space. El AOL. I remember... When I used to be like in fucking middle school, I used to make all these men all turned on and shit. And then I leave them así con blue balls and shit. <laughs> a la verga los toreaba los pendejos. Damn, bitch. I just put a super crooked nail. Super, super crooked. Me and my cousin and my sister would, would say all kinds of stupid shit. All, all kinds of stupid shit. <sighs> Zule, can you believe my phone has anxiety? Woo, for real. Zim, the best investment ever. Oh, 
I never called the hotlines because my mom would always answer the fucking other phone. That shit would be embarrassing if she picked that shit up. We would always tell our little boyfriends, be like, if I hang up, don't call me back, all right? Because my mom would hear the phone answer, click, right away, right away. So I'm not doing too much bling on the pinky, just a little, a little, little, little. All right, now let's get to this. Let's get to this um flur. Come on, let's play. Okay, let's see. Where's my my acrylics at? If I were to do this on a client, I would probably for the thumb do a solid nail or an ombre. Now it's like I can't even get a text back. All right, let me get my white acrylic so I could do her flower. Jingle bell, jingle bell. Okay, guys, let's see. I'm going to use my number one acrylic for the flower. Let me get my brush. I'm going to use the number six. Number six. And I'm gonna do the flower white only because it's gonna, um, what is it called? It's gonna pop. I just missed the whole set. Ooh, honey, I don't see arguing. Who's arguing? All right, let's do this flower power. This white is white as fuck. It's whiter than my teeth. This white is whiter than my teeth. And my teeth are fake. Hey, dang, that was fast as fuck. We can call that veneers white, like whiter than white, like colgate, huh? When I got my veneers, they're like, how white would you like them? I'm like, I don't want them too white because I don't want my yellow teeth to look too yellow. <laughs> Take a sip of wine. Mm-hmm. Three case for real. What is it? Someone mute you or you new to TikTok? Hmm? Woo 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 woo. People still talking about the three K nails? Is that Maria? Yeah, it is Maria. How'd you know? Maria paying 5K for her nails. So what? What y'all gonna say about that? I am using my number six. Um, Number six. 3D brush. 
I just noticed that somebody um that somebody made a poll. I hope the flower won because I already did it. I joined you when she couldn't afford a set for real, huh? Like welcome girlfriend. Ooh, that's looking so pretty. The flower won good because we just gave her a flower. The flower didn't win. I won. I'm reading the comments drama, so I didn't see the beginning. Yeah, people always talking shit. Whenever there's a big number of viewers, they talking shit with themselves. They dumb. Some of these people have never even been here before. They're just strangers walking through. Talking smack about my 3K nails. Some of them, not all of you. Like, it's a nail life. What is there to bicker about? For real. Just look at the nails and shut up. Just comment. Comment positive things. Nothing negative, please. We should just ignore them already. Oh, Karen's, I can function. <laughs> With nails, it's like honey. Just because just cause you're not a betty don't mean you got to comment. What was the price? Three mil pesos? It was it was three K. The negative comments disappear so fast. Yeah, we got the little squad up in here. We got Portia in on deck over here with her finger muting, blocking. We got I think Paige. I'm not sure if Stephanie in here or not. Lori. Um, who else? Who else we got up in here blocking these motherfuckers? Mm, I think um, Coco Bunny. Coco Bunny, what's your name? Oh, yeah, Julia. Blocking La Wendy, blocking. Woo. I'm just gonna do this pedal biggest shit because I don't got more space. Um, let's see. I don't have a date for scoops yet, guys. I'm still waiting for some products. As soon as I have a date, I will let you guys know. This petal kind of is looking a little funny, but it had to be done. A little fluffy. Oh, should I just notice a ring fell off? All right. Can I use wood for your next set? No, it's not looking funny, Zule. I feel like it's looking a little wonky, but what if? What if, as long as you guys don't see that, is oh shit, I'm over here like I'm done, bye. But I still need top coat, I still need the top coat. All right, guys, time for top coat. I'm gonna be using the Zule Bling Adhesive. Te quitaste acero a huevo, no lo quería quebrar. Um, I you had to see the finished look on my TikTok. 
Zule, please show your live hand before I lose it. Yeah. So I took off my main creations. This is just what is left over. If you want to see the full Nightmare Before Christmas nails, then go check out my TikTok page, like my feed or whatever, or my Instagram. It's right there with my um, zero and my skeleton. I just didn't leave those on because they're too big for me to function, literally. And I worked so hard on them, I didn't want to... I didn't want to break them. They're too cute. I'm going to save them. All right. So now it's top coat. Top coat time. Check out that flitter, honey. Wow. All right. Now let's put some. Top coat around the bling. Don't touch the bling. You can touch the little flat balls, but try to not cover the bling because then it's not going to shine. No, do not top coat the stones because you will fuck them up. You just go around them. If you happen to touch them a little bit, it's okay. Just like um the uh, the surrounding but don't cover the full crystal or else you just wasted some good bling for no reason. Oh, that's so cute, Liz. Thank you. Thank you for the little pumpkin. All right, so right there. Fuck. And then... And then this one. And then on the flower, I do not put top coat either. I just go around it. Because if you put top coat on 3D, it's going to look like plastic. Like you bought it from China and you didn't. I mean, there's nothing wrong with buying flowers from China, but we did not buy them from there. We made them. So it got to look like that. And by plastic ones, I mean the little resin ones, you know. Um, yes, I do accept clients, but only for long freestyles. So this would be like a long freestyle. Like a long, long. Alrighty, now that pinky, I'd be so shaky, I could never do this shit. You just have to do it a few times and you don't shake as much. You have to use your pinky for balance. You use your pinky for balance. Right now, I'm not lifting up my pinky, but when I draw and shit, then I do. When are you collaborating with Mimi? I just did her nails yesterday. Wait, was it yesterday or the day before? I can't remember no more. But let's see. Today's Thursday. She came on Tuesday. Alrighty, those are the nails. Now let's pop them in the lamp. Alright. I'm going to be using my not polish lamp so stick it in the lamp oh shit i just touched something her nails were fire yes i had to erase the video because it did not do well at all like it's crazy instagram Instagram is weird. Like, I don't understand it no more. Like, sometimes the videos do really good. And then sometimes they don't get seen at all. Like, what the hell? So, I ended up erasing it. And I was like, I'll post it another time. Because in the nighttime is not the time to post. <laughs> That's just what I noticed. Do not post at night. Because it doesn't get seen. 
Do you think that a polished lamp is better than the Kara Sky? Um, not necessarily better. I feel like they're both good. I haven't had this one long enough to tell, but the Kara Sky is good too. I really like this one as well because it doesn't make that noise like beep. I hate that shit. Um, did anyone just see the comment just now? Hmm? Can you show the hand from earlier I missed, please? Hold on. Let me finish curing this nail. Oh, wait. I have it right here. So, these are the nails from earlier. I just stabbed them in here so the fingers look crooked. They look they low key look like fucking fruitcake or something like that, huh? And then here is the the nails of right now. And then let me get a little napkin. I'm just waiting for it to cool down a little bit so that I can just clean the nail. How much would those green ones be? Because they buy a, they be a lot of cookies. Damn, that pinky bling is crooked for real. Like these eyes be failing me. Dude, what the fuck was I thinking? Is that honey, your finger to go that way? Your bling too? Like looking at it this way, that bling is hella crooked. <laughs> it's like just turn the finger this way. Ah, oh, shit. All right, let me clean the bling. Let me clean the bling. So there's no wax on it, no fingerprint. I'm not gonna give any prices for the nails because people talk shit about my prices. So why am I gonna give you a reason to talk more shit? So this is the final look. They came out gorgeous. I love them and I'm ready for a set like this soon. Ooh la la, so pretty. She can't close her hand properly because she got rings on, but I definitely like this hand better than the other one. So glam. Next time, I need to fucking put on my glasses. Gorge. Gorgeous. All right, guys. Well, it's time to go to sleep now. I hope you guys enjoyed our two nails that we did today. Oh, wait. Oh, man. Are they both? Oh, no. This one's a left and this one's a right hand. So here are the finished nails which ones do you like better the fall ones the orange ones or the green ones the green the green the green 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 both Good night, everyone. Green. The green is just beautiful. They're like so fucking sexy, huh? So if you like the kala, make sure to go buy it so we could all be twins and rock this kala when I put it on my nails too.
I should definitely put them on my nails soon. Ooh, the Frenchies are my favorite right now, though. Zam. Zam. All right, guys. I'll see you guys next week or I don't know when. I'll give you guys two, two designs. I will be uploading a video tomorrow to my YouTube channel. So make sure to turn on your notifications so that you do not miss out. All right. Bye, everyone. Good night. Sweet dreams. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Buenas noches. Bye, 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 everyone. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for all the likes, all the, the blockings, all the comments. I'll see you. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Una noche más y copas de más. Tú no me dejas en paz. De mi mente no te.